Well, I think the U.S. recovery from the financial crisis looks pretty decent compared to other past systemic financial crises around the world since uh, the Great Depression. And so, yeah, we wish we had a roaring economy the whole time, but when he took office, uh, things were really dire, and it could have been a lot worse. And he doesn't seem to get a lot of credit for that. I mean, we really could have had another Great Depression. It could have been a lot worse. And uh, he helped pull our way out. I mean, George Bush did also at the end of his term. He did things that he, he couldn't believe he was doing, you know, big stimulus, uh, bailing out the banks right. and everything. But uh, it worked. Of course, though, having said that, that, that's the rosy uh, version of it. Of course, so many people in this country seem so angry about where the economy is today. Poll after poll suggests that people are not happy about where things are. They would tell you that the economy is not uh, good enough and that uh, GDP, which is uh, one, one of the measures of, of where the economy is, uh, on a relative basis to where it's been historically, is uh, at a, I don't know what to say, all-time low, but a, a low. Well, sort of after the initial push, uh, he wasn't really able to get that much done. There was gridlock in Washington. The low-hanging fruit was to do a lot of infrastructure investment. The interest rates were low. Uh, Lord knows there are many places we need it. And he just wasn't able to push that through. I and mean, there are other things that could have been done in education, uh, et cetera. I think, Andrew, that a problem was the legacy of pushing through Obamacare just left such an, a hostile environment in the Republican Congress, he wasn't able to deal with them anymore, and that's a trade-off he made. If you look back on things now, he was bailing out Wall Street, well, and that's the thing he did, you I know, in terms of inequality. And, I thought Bush and Paulson and Bernanke did that. I, I don't, I didn't see the, uh, I mean, I, I know the, the auto uh, industry, but don't, a lot of it had to do with Paulson and Bush and Bernanke, don't you think? There was a lot of stuff happened after Bush left office. I mean, for example, the right. uh, when they did the bank uh, stress tests in May of uh, Obama's first term, I mean, that was a real turning point in the financial crisis, uh, how to actually apply TARP. There was, there was still, a, you know, quite a continuation. He doubled down right. on what the stimulus was. I mean, he did a lot. But, you know, again, if you look back at the complaints today about Wall Street versus inequality, uh, the Obamacare decision doesn't look quite as crazy. It was a tough decision to try to make. I mean, I'm doing all this for Wall Street. I have to balance it. I, I don't think it was uh, easy choices. And I think history will look reasonably favorably on his legacy.